Hi Aquarius, this is Sean from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back. And if anybody has landed on this channel for the first time, welcome to the channel. I hope you enjoy this general reading. If it doesn't resonate with you, have a look at your moon sign or your rising sign. And please subscribe and hit the bell on all. And I would also suggest to my cyber angels, my loyal followers or viewers, um, to refresh the refresh the button the bell and all as well on all your favorite channels it might fix the si a situation by not not getting notified and have a look at your settings in your back office allow YouTube to notify you I will make a video on that so that you can see how to do that and uh, so bear with with it at the moment but make sure that you are notified and set on all and on every channel and your back office okay so here we go we're going to do your reading for the 31st to the 6th of September 2020 so first of all we have the six of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles um, says in this deck, Bounty. You might be the less fortunate one, so you will be receiving something, a gift, perhaps money, or perhaps a helping hand, or a listening ear. If you're not, if you're the one that's more fortunate, you'll be giving it, but if you're less fortunate, you'll be receiving it. This is the Share and Share Alike card for me because if you do it yourself as well then when you're in need you will get it back threefold everything if you've done bad you'll get it back in threefold as well that's usually my world and my wheel of fortune that are my karma cards but you can see this as a bit of a karma card as well okay the card that you have uh, to clarify it is a beautiful card from the mystical deck rather I call it mystical because it takes you to the fairy lands and the mystical lands and it's so beautiful just look at the little baby in the middle of the dandelion that is those are the seeds of a dandelion the flower has turned to seeds to start life again and yes you are going to start something perhaps you might start a relationship or a friendship with a Gemini a Libra or a, a Aquarius this is also this is the ace of air the ace of swords so victory is yours you might find out that you're pregnant so that could be um, let's have a look nine months from now that is June so uh, beginning of September uh, the end of September nine months from then it will be June so it could be a Gemini that is being born you might be pregnant of an early Gemini Wow that's amazing but things will become clear to you uh, justice will be done if you're in a judicial situation you might be receiving money from the person that has done you wrong Wow I hadn't even thought about that you see how it works it just comes in this message is for somebody out there as I'm reading for thousands of people perhaps more than one person justice will be done <clears throat> because you have victory something will become clear to you perhaps about your financial situation or who is helping you perhaps somebody might have been giving you money anonymously and you'll be get be getting clarity who this might have been this could have been a Gemini a Libra or an Aquarium and something will become clear to you perhaps you might start a new study get a wisdom perhaps you might start to be a bookkeeper a bookkeeper works with coins and this is how I see something um, relating to the card of the air and the six of Pentacles perhaps you might even um, like I said join friendships or relationships a business partner rela uh, partnership um, somebody that's more fortunate to start a business if you want to start a business it could be a sleeping partner the baby is sleeping is very quiet that is what a sleeping partner is 
Uh, okay, Aquarius, in the midweek we have the um, rebirth uh, card. That is justice. And again, you see the baby. So a baby is quite important to you this week because you might be finding out you're pregnant. If you don't want to get pregnant, take precautions. And if you've been longing to have a baby, then the world is your oyster. The Justice card is also a card of new beginnings. As usually, it is the rising dead that are standing up and uh, being... Uh, 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 beautiful air is blown or life is blown in them again by Archangel um, Raphael but here we've got a pagan deck so it's the green man which is the Emperor that is showing a new beginning he might be giving you a new beginning or a second chance perhaps with an air sign if you are looking to partner up and you are in your strength. In this new beginning, you are in the strength. You might be the leader. The strength is also Leo. So you might be um, reconciling with an air sign or a Leo. There is a second chance. This could be in work. This could be in business. This could be in love. Beautiful. Then at the weekend, on Friday, I mean, you have the Four of Cups. There is more on offer than you realize. You might be too much up in your head. You might be de depressed. Look, at she's not looking happy. She's only seeing what she's got and not and is not seeing what she ha is around her on offer or what she does have. And I get a feeling with this reading, look around at what you have and not at what you don't have. Because then you do get stuck in the doldrums. Because you've got more than you will realize. So focus on what you have and what you could have. Um, be grateful and ask the divine and the angels for help to get what you need or what you want. Be careful when you wish, okay? Don't be discontent. Be always grateful. Show gratitude. Help others wherever you can. If you haven't got money, you can always give a listening ear or a helping hand. Here you've got the three of water, so there are celebrations. And in this deck, it looks like melting together. So um, definitely I think there is a new partnership or a reconciliation here, a rebirth of something. Don't ponder about it, okay? Perhaps you've been pondering about it. How can I fix this situation? It has to come from both sides. So there will be celebrations. Whatever happens, there will be celebrations. You've got a lot to be thankful for. For example, your health your strength, your um, determination to get started in something new, to share your love, to share your uh, abilities, your capabilities, your knowledge, a helping hand, whatever. You'll get it back threefold, but only do something if you want to do it, and only do it if you can do it with a um, with love and care. It will come back to you. It always does. That's what we call karma. You are moving away from difficulties as you've got the Six of Swords. You might be moving home. You might be going on holiday and crossing water. You're leaving rough waters behind. So don't worry if you are in a rough situation because you are strong and you've got the new beginnings. You might even meet somebody new, like I said. There will be celebrations because this something is melting, coming together. Wow, this is a powerful reading. And then you have the Night of Fire. And I was just saying, you might be moving home. The Night of Fire brings you news and when you get this is the king of fire sorry is the king of fire be determined at the weekend like the king of fire take the status of the king 
know where you want to go and get into action and be creative on how to get it be logical okay be realistic and be transparent you might meet a fire sign as you've got the Leo here it could be an Aries the king is Aries but don't forget um, Leo and Sagittarius now I was talking about the knight of fire well he's here as well so that is all the three fire signs look at this dragon traveling and flying through the air the magical dragon so you will be getting news so again you might be meeting Aries Leo or Sagittarius act upon this news swiftly before it passes you by now you have the law keeper so you might be in a judicial situation um, um, with regards to this new beginning not having enough money like I said the swords are justice communication and wisdom so victory is yours you will get what you deserve karma and you'll get it back threefold so you have the card from the Avalonian as the lawmaker or the law keeper I beg your pardon she has a wheel in her hand like I said the wheel of fortune you can see it back that's karma and I hadn't really twigged at that in the, right at the beginning because I read the cards as when I come to them but my feelings already start working without me realizing um, what the whole story is and you know truth is um, important to you here and to keep the balance and justice this is quite precedent here and morality you might be the advocate like I said if you are better off than the other okay you might be an, an advocate for somebody uh, uh, you might be also for um, going forward and taking action there you are but meditate to get clarity be objective and live in the now and okay now the presence of the law keeper signals um, that there is need for balances and you need more information you need clarity not only from your inner world don't be asleep don't be in your head come out and take action and seek the right information or help from uh, somebody that is a law keeper an advocate a jurist or a social worker or a doctor if that is your needs it, somebody from an institutional or a municipality you need to perhaps seek advice on something it could be about your money and how to um, uh, help somebody lawfully if you are well off perhaps you might be able to give a gift legally and claim it back from the income tax okay well anyway this is a beautiful reading so if you uh, want to help somebody remember you'll get it back threefold or perhaps you're the less fortunate one and you might be getting help you might be seeking legal advice or um, financial advice that's also an institute the bank to get a loan to buy this new house because we've got two cards for moving home perhaps you are thinking on buying a house uh, on your own or together with a new partner so seek the right advice to get to your goal so that you will be able to celebrate victory is yours I think money is coming to you really because like the wheel you've been down and out and now you're going to be fine you are going to be more fortunate that is what I see in the cards and that is more I feel more like that than that than anything else so seek the right advice to take the next step I hope you've enjoyed this reading 
Take care and enjoy your new future or your next step. Please share and like and give us the thumbs up. Thank you.